This is the new Netgear Orbi Wi-Fi 6E mesh system, and they're here to save your home internet. Welcome everybody to Apple Insider. It is Andrew here, and I am checking out the all new Orbi Wi-Fi 6E mesh router setup. And I am extremely impressed in my testing so far. But before I get into too many of the details about what is Wi-Fi 6E, why you should care, and why these routers are so good, I do have to acknowledge that this video is sponsored. But as always, I'm gonna be upfront with you guys. I'll tell you the things that I like, and I'm gonna tell you the things that I don't like. So let's go ahead and get into it. And if you have any questions, throw them up in the comments down below. So Orbi is created by Netgear. Netgear has been in the business for over 25 years, creating industry-leading products across the board, from switches to routers to everything you need to maintain your home network. I'm specifically looking at the Orbi Wi-Fi 6E RBKE963B. This is a three-unit setup, so one router as well as two satellite units. It'll give you about 9,000 square feet of coverage for your home, and you can get up to 10.8 gigabits per second of data to individual devices on your network. You can connect up to 200 devices on your network at one time, and yeah, there's a lot of specs to talk about, so we'll come back to those. Before, let's talk about Wi-Fi 6E and why you should care about it in your home. Wi-Fi 6E is the latest generation of wireless networking for your home or your business. Basically, it adds a bunch of benefits over prior generations of Wi-Fi. For example, it adds its support for the 6 gigahertz band to spectrum. So there was 2.4 and there was 5. You usually see those on routers. Wi-Fi 6E is adding the 6 gigahertz band into the mix. This is a free space that has not been used before, so it has a lot more room to play with, and you're going to see increased speeds over prior generations of Wi-Fi. This is also especially useful in crowded areas like cities and apartment buildings, and it even can save battery life on your devices. It actually allows them to spend more time in sleep and less time sending data. So in overall, you actually get longer battery life on your home devices. So why Orbi? Aside from Netgear's pedigree, these things have a lot of specs to back up their game. So for starters, they look amazing. I love the look of this two-tone with the silver and the black. Like, these are like a sexy looking router. Can a router look sexy? I, I think they can. These are great looking routers, and they do come in white if that's more your aesthetic, but these black ones are definitely more my speed. As I said, I am setting up the three pack here in my home. So aside from the three pack, there is a two pack available and you can always pick up additional satellites. So your three pack is gonna give you 9,000 square feet of coverage. Your two pack is gonna give you 6,000 feet of coverage, uh, square feet of coverage. And then every additional satellite that you buy will give you 3,000 square feet more of additional coverage around your home. The primary router that you're gonna to connect to your modem, this has a 10 gigabit ethernet port in the back, which is absolutely insane. Plus you have additional downstream ports and the satellite routers themselves, they will have a two and a half gigabit ethernet port on them. So you can hardwire them in and get incredible speed that way. But you can also connect these just and they have their own dedicated backhaul. So you're gonna have amazing speed and performance no matter which device you're connected to. So as you move around your home, your devices are gonna choose the router that makes sense for them. You don't have to do anything and you're gonna get incredible speed no matter where you are. For me, home internet is incredibly important. I'm a video creator and I'm constantly downloading and uploading footage, so bandwidth is crucial to my job. But it's not just me, both my wife and I work from home at our home office and home studio and we need internet to be able to work. We also are gamers, so I want fast internet speed so I don't have crappy buffers that's gonna end up me losing a match. And I also stream all of our video content. If we wanna watch TV, we wanna watch Apple TV+, Plus, Hulu, Netflix, whatever it is, I need to be able to stream that footage. And these routers ensure it's not just 1080p or 4K. I could stream 8K content with these routers without issue. And for anyone who knows me, they know this is a smart home. So I have a ton of devices across this home, including a ton of security cameras that we want to be able to stream while we're not home. And routers are crucial to that. These can support up to 200 devices all at the same time. And that's easily enough to cover all my smart home devices and everything else that I have going on. I told you I'd tell you things that I don't like too. And if there was one thing that I wish these routers supported, it's Apple HomeKit. But so far, there are very few routers that actually take advantage of HomeKit, so I don't blame Netgear for not including an Orbi, but it is something that I would like to see, as this is primarily an Apple HomeKit home. With everything that we do, finding a mesh router system that could keep up with our demand 
has been at the top of our list. And I think I finally found it with the Orbi. It's incredibly easy to set up, really easy to use, really easy to manage through the application. There's a ton of additional features like parental controls and neck gear armor that can protect your devices in real time. There's a lot of stuff. I have been incredibly impressed with these routers and I test a lot of routers. I am sticking with these things at least for a while. These have been my favorite routers that I have tested and I think you should check them out too. If you're interested, there's a link for them down below in the description. Thank you again to Netgear for sponsoring this video. Otherwise, stay tuned. We got a lot more video coverage coming your way.